Ron Caps out of the number two qualifying position, who was only bested by his stablemate. Matt Hagen with his Hellcat Dodge. How about Terry Haddock using the classic backup girl in the sparkling sequin dress, high boots? That's something that has been happening here at New England Dragway for more than 50 years. The CircleRacing.com, Strut Masters, Wolf Pumps, Ford Mustang. And for Ron Caps. Just watching the routine. They are a well pennzoiled machine over there. The men and women that make up the crew over there working with Dean Antonelli, John Medlin. A nod from one side of the racetrack to the other, a signal to the drivers. So go get this done. This is a biggie right here. Winner goes to the semifinals. Ron hazes the tires and check it out. Terry had it, got him. 421, 253 miles an hour. You cannot let one of those big teams get away with making a mistake. Ron's team made a mistake and Terry Haddock made him pay. 421, 253 miles an hour for the win. Ron goes 429 at 263 miles an hour. Ron's car was really marching out there through the middle and then it got in trouble. About the 600 foot mark or so and Terry Haddock was able to sneak by. Terry Haddock gets the win and will solo into the semifinals as we watch again on the NHRA.TV replay. Right here, it looks like the Napa Dodge is charging on to victory, but this is what you got to do. If you're Haddock, go down the track, make the run you can make, and don't let them get away with a mistake. See a lot of sparks out of Ron's car down there at the finish line. I'm not sure if it tossed the clutch out or maybe had some other kind of an issue, but Terry Haddock doesn't care. He's going to the next round, far into the racetrack. Right here, the Napa car looks great, and I mean, it just pulled him loose. Ron gives it a pedal. Well, it looks like he's got a little fire going on under the body down there in the Napa car. He was doing anything he could possibly do to get to the finish line, and he did. He just didn't get there in front of Terry Haddock. So the circle racing team is going on to round number two. I'm not sure he knows. He looks like he's, that's Terry going, are you sure I won? I won? Did I win? Yes, Terry, you won. <laughs> hey, when you're an independent team that's out here chasing the dream and don't have a big budget, anytime you can take down a guy like that, that's the kind of reaction you're going to get. Terry Haddock has been doing this for so long and has said time after time, I'm not smart enough to quit. And days like today make it seem worthwhile when he can knock off one of the big dogs here in round number one just like that. There's the margin of victory, about a car length. And the circle racing wheels forward is out in front of the Napa Auto Parts Dodge.